Hey gang, welcome to another edition of Doc's Dumpster, where it's a review of the movie Deuce Bigelow, Male Gigolo. Now I want to apologize uh, up front for not having a video up yesterday. Um, this weekend my buddy and I are running a yard sale, and I just completely forgot to get a video up yesterday. Um, but, doing this one... <laughs> Oh, uh, boy, boy, boy. Well, of course, this one is about a guy named Deuce Bigelow. And, um... And he he has a job cleaning aquariums, but he gets fired from it because he was... He was naked in one of them. Uh, good way to start the movie, huh? So he gets a house call from a male prostitute named Antoine to to clean up his big fishy aquar aquarium aquarium <laughs> he winds up destroying it and Deuce tries to figure out a way to try to replace the aquarium and everything like that and he decides to follow in Antoine's footsteps and become a male gigolo unfortunately all the women that he goes to be with and everything like that are ones that you would almost swear up and down grew up next to a nuclear power plant. <laughs> yeah. And he also has a detective named uh, named Fowler who's who's trailing him, although he really wants Antoine's little black book. Well, everything goes goes really, really bad for Deuce. He winds up in jail and and uh, then he goes on trial and well all the women that Deuce has been with, they pretty much help him get out of get out of uh, get out of the problem. He's cleared of all the charges. He replaces a broken aquarium, and everything seems to be a okay. And Antoine returns home, taps on the glass, aquarium falls apart. He tries to kill Deuce. Deuce winds up having Antoine arrested, and Deuce winds up. Marrying this one girl he was he uh, kind of fell in love with in the movie named Kate And it pretty much the movie winds up with a With a montage of what happened to pretty much everybody else in the movie And as you can see right there of course movie stars Rob Schneider now I don't remember anybody else being in this movie. There was a big name star, but um but of course, the big question is, does this movie belong in a dumpster? Yeah, big time. This was a movie that if I were to put in a, in a, in a list of, of unfunny Rob Schneider comedies, this would be in there. And also, it's another one of those movies that a lot of people drove me nuts with. They all said, oh man, Rob Schneider, he's funny in this. It's a great movie. It's hilarious and, and all this. But to tell, you the to tell you the truth, I just didn't care for this one. I mean, I like some of Rob Schneider's movies, whether he's starring in them or co-starring in them. But, but this was one that was just really unfunny and... Uh, It just kind of makes you wonder, why on earth did he do this movie? And the only thing I could think of was he was guaranteed a sequel. <laughs> and if you're wondering, will I be reviewing the sequel? Yeah, I, w I will be sometime in the near future. Don't know when, but it'll happen. But this movie, I just, I, I didn't really care for it all that much. I just didn't think it was funny. Um... He he can he can he can be good in some movies and um, and I'm gonna try and review quite a few Rob Schneider movies and some like I said some are my favorites and some were ones I just didn't really care all that much for. Um, but yeah, this one not great, not funny. But the part that gets to me is you know he he marries the uh, he marries the one girl with a with with a plastic leg. And yet, he's back in part two. That always kind of confused me a little bit, but... 
yeah. Weird thing was about a lot of my friends after watching this movie, they found they found it hilarious, but they also said, "No way am I going to be a male gigolo." <laughs> and I thought like anybody would even take you guys. <laughs> but there you guys have it, a review of Deuce Bigelow, Male Gigolo. If you like my videos, feel free to subscribe. And if you got a movie you think deserves to be put into a dumpster and then probably smashed and hopefully nothing leaks out of it, especially the movie you want put in the dumpster, send it my way and I'll get on it ASAP. Thank you guys so very, very much for watching. And until next time, as always, stay strong and rock on.